Hey there YouTube, this is Next Charge here with Prisma Glads. Yay. Um post September first, twenty ten. Yeah. So, um with Rescue Cat gone, um well yeah, I think a lot of players should like uh, a lot of Glad to Beast players would probably go for like Prisma Glads since well, yeah. Um to be honest if you this uh build is well Missing one or two cards, well, uh, but I'll tell you, um, yeah, when we get to them. Yeah, it's recommended to run three test tigers, but I can't find my third one, so, yeah, that's bad. Um, the reason why I'm not running, uh, the reason why a lot of players, and the reason why we don't actually run three Thunder King Rider is because the third one, yeah, can kind of clog the hand and stuff. Um, I'm actually just running to get the beast um respite because because well even though I have a third one I'm just gonna try starting out with two first. Uh another thing to know is that this build does not have um dark hole because um I was thinking for a while and I feel that it won't actually fit my playstyle because dark hole will probably kill my monsters and in this format with like three black rose dragons will definitely need like to max out chariot. Yeah. Um two MST. Oh just like not much space on the mat. Yeah. One monster reborn. Monster reborn Vistiari, tag into Geyserus. Fun stuff. One co wave, one giant trinade. Lighting. <coughs> yeah. I like Glads, cause Gladiator Beast like always tends to survive every format. They are actually like inbred, uh, inborn survivors. Like survivors like coded in their genes. Hmm, interesting. After all, they're gladiators. Three Gladiator, ch Gladiator War Chariot. Yeah, Gladiator Beast War Chariot. Uh, <clears throat> two D prisons. Um, two bottomless trap holes. Two dust tornado. If you want, these two cards can actually be Dark Bribe or Waboku. Yeah, just pointing it out there. Because I know a lot of my Gladiator Beast friends like to like main deck Waboku. But, um, yeah. Feeling is it. Oh, yeah, you can also main Trap Stun instead. Trap Stun, Geyserus. Trap Stun into Geyserus is fun stuff. Uh, trap Dash Shoot, uh, Starlight Road, Solemn Judgment, and Mirror Force. Okay, yeah. This is pretty much the well main overall structure. Now I'll actually go on to talk about what I think about the future or rather or rather um gladiator beast in the upcoming format. Where and if you want to know the extra deck is like just three guys are and two Herc Heraclinos, yeah, standard. Um Yeah, I think they'll still be pretty much surviving, but the problem is that due to normal heavy storm, that actually serves as a good thing for gladiator beast and royal the royal oppression being limited also serves as a pretty good thing. <coughs> um, I feel that if the format becomes like um, trap heavy format, um, I feel that that could could be a problem for gladiator beast. But then again, <coughs> gladiator beast has <coughs> excuse me. Um, well, sort of already adapted to that kind of playstyle. Um, let me think. <coughs> well, with well, if you main three chariot, you shouldn't really have that much problem. And since you're main decking Starlight Road, which I can see a lot of well, I can see almost all Gladiator Beast players like main decking Starlight Road, which even happened in this format, which. Never mind, I'm making no sense. Sorry. <laughs> okay, um Yeah. Uh then you already have to fear for the ODK decks unless you have a really bad and sucky hand. Um yeah, I was also thinking of main decking Gauss inside the build, but after some thought, um nah, I think I'll focus on trying to find my third test tiger first. Yeah. So that's actually the deck. Um Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching guys, take care.